Hello guys, I'm back with another low quality tutorial. For this tutorial, we'll explain how, why, and how to fix the fix of the fix the black parts model on Mana's Genshin shader. Before we get started, we I'll explain some disclaimers, which can be a lot. First, you'll need MD. If you don't have MD, then there are tutorials on how to download that. If you don't use MMD, then I can't help you. I'm sorry. Because the perp this is an MD tutorial. If you don't have this program, then I can't help you. Second one, you'll need Miku Miku Effect, which is this button here. It is, this allows you to load effects, just like this one here. Yeah, if you don't have it, then there are plenty of tutorials on how to download that. Which by default it won't. This will not come if you just downloaded an MD. Then the fourth one. Then third, you'll need PMX editor because you'll need PMX editor in order to use the shader, anyways. Which will lead to the fourth disclaimer: you'll need to know how to use the shader itself. If you don't, then this tutorial cannot will not explain because if you're watching this, I assume you know how to use the shader. The shader. There are a few tutorials on how to use that. Like, I think just three. Whatever, they're helpful. Now, this is six one. You would need. I'm using a playbox slash really, really models. Because I assume fan ripped models will not uh, have this problem. Then the seventh one, I'm using version 0.1.3 of a shader, because that's the best version for these official model ports. In the last one, I'm using one high, I think that's how you pronounce that. No, actually, I'm not sure. Post 1.0 models. Yes, they all have this problem. Because the 1.0 models that they ported, like Ether, they will not have this problem. So... Let's explain why this happened. Let's get into it. So, if you go into the texture folder of your model, like here, spin it, you'll find these kind of te transparent textures here. Yeah, that's the problem. You see, as you can see, shader, the shader will have this problem. If you're wondering why this happens to the blush or the closed eyes more, you just need to don't, just don't load the shader on them. That's what I've been told. Just don't. It won't. Because it doesn't even need the shader. So you see here, it's like transparent. Yeah. That's the reason why this happens. And before we get into dive on how to fix it, if your model has premate already has uh, this fix for you, like this will happen on pre post 1.4. This will happen on 1.4, like, or later models. They will not. They'll already have it pre-made for you. Like, you don't have to add, merge the layers together, if you know what I mean. Which I'll let explain. So, yeah, let's go. So, this is fixing for the body, by the way, because this is the most common. I'll just delete this, because... So first, open up the any art program. Online photo editors will work too. Then you just open any of these. Then you add the second body texture as a layer. Do not make it as new. Then it doesn't matter what order because it'll just fit either way. Once you're done with that, just save it. I already have it saved, so I won't do that. Then open PMX editor the with open the model that's compatible with the shader it's supposed if it looks like this you're good if you if it doesn't please apply the light the light maps shadow ramps uh, that kind of stuff because without it you won't the shader won't work then find the body Parts, which I know are these, this, 
group here and then change it to um, the new texture I know mine was this but the, uh, uh, no. or you can just click on the the blue square and file open then press change which I can show you go here text Yes, it doesn't need to be in the model folder or else it won't work. This. Then you click change. By the way, this will only happen with one part at a time. It will not happen to multiple. And as you can see, it's not as transparent as before. If your model has an alpha part like beta, which I'll do, because I already, of course, so many times. Bear with me. Oh my gosh. PMX Editor. I use you all the time. Are you tired of me? So yeah, if it... If your model has an alpha part like Albedo, you just need to delete it because it's useless for this shader. Because... If you don't delete it, then it'll be black. So once that's done, now there's facial accessories. Like, this is why you use Bennett, because he has facial accessories. Like his bandage on his nose. Now here's how to fix it, which took me a while how to figure it out. Find the face texture. Then you add the facial accessory texture, which is the bandage in this case. I'm pretty sure it's only Bennett so far that has this kind of thing. Whatever, let's just save it. Just save it, which I won't save because I already have it saved. Then you find the facial accessory, which is this bandage. I know I worked around Bennett a couple times. Then, once again, change it to whatever, just name it this. Once you're done, save it. I'm going to save it as a separate one, just in case this tutorial goes wrong. I'm just going to put two, because, yeah. Once that's done, go to MD, delete the old model if you already loaded it. Delete this one. Then load it. Load the new model. Go to in the effect and just apply the shader. And if I'm not wrong, the problem is fixed. So I hope this helped. If you have any questions, consider it putting in the comments section. If it didn't work, then just explain in the comments section. I can help work that out. So, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.